I'm Kendall Clausen. Social media has become our main platform for communication, one with another and even with our government today. Um, it is very much a mirror for what we started in the Enlightenment period when we had the public sphere. This idea of coming together and uh, voicing opinions and beliefs so that they could create a change within their society. Uh, today, we wake up to these forms of social media and to this very modern public sphere. Um, we seek to be heard as a people and as individuals. It is human nature to seek to be heard. This is why we have many other forms of ways to be um, heard through these gatherings, marches and parades, fighting for something to change within our world. Um, after the public sphere and the enlightenment period, we saw progress into what we fought for our independence with 13 colonies. Uh, they were, the British were taxing these colonists um, without representation. And when these colonists found this out and um, wished to change what was going on in their societies, they went and marched out and protested against this. This eventually turned into what was uh, the war. And eventually we fought and won our independence in this way. Um, we can see that we are trying to do the same sort of thing in our, within our society. Um, but a lot of the times there are um, false alarms that happen and fake news um, within our social medias. Some people think it's, it's funny and it's trendy to do these things. Um, like for instance, call attention to something that doesn't need so much attention. Um, like someone saying that there's maybe something going on at a mall with a gunman or something and the police and authorities come and it's this big ordeal, there's a lot of panic and with this, um, there really is nothing going on. They're, they waste time and money and energy that way. Um, and a lot of the other times, like in the last year in January, there was an amber alert about a missile coming towards Hawaii. And people saw the truth uh, through Twitter and they found out that that was a false alarm as well. Um, we can see how powerful social media is. Um, just by these little uh, examples. And they're causing more harm than good. Um, yeah, social media makes us a democracy nowadays. And we, s we need to use it a lot more better in this way. It is shaping our future. And this is um, starting with trusting and working with these news platforms and not putting out fake news and just being aware of what is out there and we can all do better.